Hi guys, my name is Ilya. In this video I will show you how to create an RTK base from uBlocks ZF9 D board. Then I will connect it to NTR IP caster and hopefully get a fixed solution on the rover. It is pretty hot here in Cyprus, so I made my setup on the balcony. It leads to not optimal sky view, but at least protects me from the melting down. First thing first, let's look at the inventory that I used. I will put links to all hardware and software to the video description. As a receiver I used Ardu Simple RTK 2B Revision 1 board. Uh, it is connected to Genesis antenna with coaxial cable and also connected to Android phone with USB-C to micro USB OT OTG cable. The phone provides power and internet connection, so r simple can broadcast corrections to the caster. Before starting to use the board, some configuration is required. To do so, let's download uBlocks you center to PC. For some reason, this DLL is not included in your center and should be installed separately. I will include the link to this file in the video description. Now we are ready to connect our board to the PC and large U center. Select board rate and port. It is always a good idea to make a copy of receiver config before we change it. Uh, next, let's open a message view window. Messages window consists of multiple sections, but all manipulation I will do in UBX uh, CFG. In the config section I revert configuration to default and press send button. Then click Messages subsection. Here I select one by one all RTSM messages that the base will broadcast. Uh, these messages will be sent uh, to USB port. Then I switch to navigation subsection and set dynamic model to stationary. Next, uh, let's check USB port settings. As you can see here, receiver will broadcast RTSM messages to USB port. Then go to Time Mode 3 subsection and enable a survey in mode. In this mode, the board will collect and average its position on turn on uh, till it reaches both time and accuracy breakpoints. The more precise position we want, the more time we should spend. 
The last thing to do is to save settings in permanent memory. The board is ready to act as RTK base. Now let's connect it with the phone and antenna and proceed to NTR IP server settings. Download YC server from the Google Play Market. Launch it. As a source of data, I will use a serial port source. As destination, I will use YC Caster. It is free and trip casters that does not require authorization. Enter the mount point name that you like and uh, any random password. Select our source and destination. Uh, then press the launch button and uh, see how that uh, starts broadcasting to uh, interrupt caster. Then I connected my RTK rover to same mount point and it seems pretty well. It's receiving data and have a fixed solution. Uh, thank you for watching. If you like this video, please share, like and ask your question in the comments. Thank you for watching, guys. Bye.